Hey guys, what is up? Red Panda Mining here. How you guys all doing? I hope you're all doing really well and having a great day. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys the profits for the month of October for my single Radeon 7, which I have bought on March 23rd of 2019 of this year. I keep track of all of the profits every month and here I am showcasing to you guys for the month of October. So, I have been mining Ethereum Classic on my Radeon 7 for the past month on, on October. And yeah, as you guys can see, I'm getting about 88 to 89 mega hash mining Ethereum Classic on ethermine.org at the moment. So yeah, as you can see, uh, the temperatures right now is 53 degrees Celsius, 100% fan. Right now it says 170 watts. But the kilowatt meter that I've had on this rig before shows exactly 220 watts, okay, uh, plus another 50 watts for the motherboard and CPU. So total, the whole system for my single Radeon 7 is taking about 280 watts at the wall. Okay, guys, so let's get into the profits here. So with Ethereum Classic for since October 1st till October 30th, okay, uh, as of making this video, okay, the price of Ethereum Classic is $5.02 uh, USD for a single Ethereum Classic. So for the 30 days that I've been mining, the, my single Radeon 7 has garnered about 7 Ethereum Classic, okay? And so total, I've mined 26 Ethereum Classic throughout my whole journey of this card, okay? And the coin mined worth, okay, this column here shows seven times five dollars and one cent would be about uh, thirty-five dollars and seven cents for this for the month of October. And you guys can see the hash rate and the wattage at the wall, which I explained earlier. And then the big the big thing here is the wattage, uh, how much power consumptions that I've used. So at two hundred and eighty watts um, for the month of October it would cost about thirteen dollars and sixty three cents in order to uh, pretty much mine at this at this wattage here and you guys can see um, how I calculated that is wattage price and I have the levy levy fee which is only 0 0.046 a day okay not an hour that's a day and then crisis fund is 0 0.0061 a day plus taxes I have five percent USD and you guys can see the example wattage calculations for those that are new to my channel and wondering how I calculated my my kilowatt per hour uh, costs is right here. Okay, so uh, 0 0.280 is two, 280 watts. Okay, so that's my example calculation. Uh, you guys can pretty much use this formula as well if you'd like. Okay, continuing uh, the profits that I mined and watts is $21 and 44 cents so pretty much I just minus the $13 here minus the coined mind worth okay so that's how I got this $21 and 44 cents so if I were to sell right now I would gain $21 and 44 cents uh, for this month of profit okay and yeah but I am not selling anything okay I haven't sold anything yet uh, I have I have said here I'm hodling all the coins I like until enough I hit uh, enough to hit break even, or when I feel it is a good time to sell to take some profits. Okay, uh, and then this last column here, you guys can see the original price used plus electrical. Uh, okay, so I'm I'm calculating the original price of the card, uh, which I bought on March 23rd, 2019, for 781 dollars and 26 cents USD. Okay, and then. Uh, you guys can see here that every every column here I've added uh, the cost per kilowatt hour, uh, the wattage price here to this. So right now I'm in the hole for $883.20. I have not taken any fiat out. I haven't taken any profits. I've been hodling all the coins. <clears throat> As you guys can see here, 26 Ethereum. I have 0 0.8 Monero. Uh, Callisto, about 1,356 Callisto and 60 vert coin at the moment and you you guys can see the total value of my whole earnings of all my coins at the moment as of making this video um, I'll show you guys my wallet right uh, right in a second here uh, $196.51 okay so if I were to sell all of my coins right now I would garner about 190 to 200 dollars USD okay so I'm not gonna do that because obviously it's pretty much low time in the markets 
But I want to show you guys my Coinomi wallet just to give you guys uh, a better view of how much coins I've mined. Okay guys, here's my just an old iPhone, iPhone 6S and I have the Coinomi app installed here. Uh, I've been mining all of my coins for my Radeon 7, or for most of my coins, uh, to this Coinomi app here. So, as I showed you guys earlier, I was mining Callisto, Ethereum Classic, Monero, and Vertcoin. I actually tried to tried to move my Vertcoin to the Coinomi app here, but it hasn't moved yet. So, I'm going to figure that out later. Uh, but as you can see, as of right now, my whole wallet is worth about $181.82 USD. And you guys can see I have about 26 Ethereum Classic and 0 0.8 Monero and 1,382 Callisto. Okay, so pretty cool. You guys can see the Ethereum Classic that I was mining for the past uh, two days. Uh, let's see here. Oh, sorry, for the past month, not two days. So October 4th, there's one. October 8th, there's another one. So two, 13, 3, 17, 4, 21, 5. Uh, October 25th, 6th, and then October 30th, uh, 7th. So I've mined 7 Ethereum Classic for my Radeon 7 total here. Okay? Alright guys, well, I'm going to see you guys back on the computer. Alright guys, so we're back on the computer. You guys can see, so total plus the Konomi app plus my Vertcoin is about almost 200 bucks USD. Okay? Now, I want to talk about what coin should I be mining next. So I've been recording this video a little bit later. It's now November 2nd. You guys will see this video tomorrow, so November 3rd. I've already, I've stuck with mining Ethereum Classic. I'm just going to, I'm going to stay on Ethereum Classic for this month of November. Okay, so we'll see how much we garnered. Another thing I want to show you guys is my uptime in Windows. <laughs> okay, so I've been mining Ethereum Classic here. You guys can see the hours is 614 hours. Okay, so 614 hours. Divided by 24 is, I've had a 25.5 day uptime for my single Radeon 7 in Windows so far. So I'm gonna, I'm curious to see. Uh, I actually did have like a small power outage uh, at the third or fourth day, so that's why I haven't had the 30 full 30 days here. But uh, I'm gonna continue this trend. I want to see if I can get up to uh, 60 days or the. Uh, 55 days for the end of uh, November okay so uh, yeah so that's gonna be fun so I think I'm just gonna keep mining ethereum classic that seems to be the most profitable coin at this moment for I guess AMD cards or the sapphire radeon 7 for example so yeah I'm gonna continue to mine ethereum classic you guys can see so stay tuned for that video and then um, I just want to do a quick what to mine here for my radeon 7 so I've already entered my hash rates uh, do 0 0.067 kilowatt hour hit calculate and yeah ethereum classic eth hash seems to be you know the profitable coin for this radeon 7 at the moment uh you know callisto's looking up like it's uh coming up there ether one pearl cork cork chain huh dubai coin uh ubic uh vert coins down there rio rio's down there uh, yeah, not looking too good for those coins. So, um, but you know, I'm mining for the long haul. The profitability doesn't really matter. I mean, all the altcoins are really relative in price anyway. They've all been going straight down, straight down, and <laughs> in terms of of price. So, you know, we're we're all praying for altcoin season. I I really hope that it could come back. Who knows? 2017, early 2018 was definitely a uh, a unicorn uh, time I, I feel so I feel like it may not come back I don't know just my gut feeling not financial advice but anyways guys let me know what you think I'm gonna keep mining ethereum classic all that good stuff and I will see you guys in the next video smash the like button subscribe also click the notification bell so you guys get all of my updates of I release a video every day as well as feel free to use my Amazon affiliate links down below it helps me, helps out the channel. I get a little kickback or commission off that at no cost to you. You guys just have to click on it, and if you buy anything, it helps me out. So, I will see you guys in the next one. Have a good one, and peace out.